The purpose of my videos is to make people laugh, but today we're going to do something different. Today we're going to be educational. We're going to learn about something that I hate, and there are only two things in the world that I hate. People who want to take people's freedoms away, which you all already know, and thoughts. To start, what is a thought? Urban Dictionary's top definition defines a thought as a girl who sends nudes of herself to everyone and the definition also acknowledges the original meaning of thought which is an acronym standing for that hoe over there. However it has become so much more than just that and there's a variety of behaviours that a girl can have that would make them a thought and I'm going to go through some of the behaviours in this video. Unfortunately I can't include any video examples of these behaviours because I don't want to get copy striked. 4. A burning hatred for women. The thought market is a capitalist market, which means that it is very competitive and only the strong survive. Thoughts, just like companies, have to compete for resources, except in the thoughts case, resources are 12 year olds with a PayPal account. So it works in the same sense of there's always a bigger fish, except in this case it's there's always a thoughtier thought. 3. Love for money. Thoughts love money, and they want your money, and they will do their best to get you to part with your money, as long as it doesn't involve too much effort, because the idea of a hard day's work is a foreign concept to a thought. A good example of this would be Twitch thoughts versus actual cam girls. Now, actual cam girls will show you anything you want and also do anything you want if you give them money, whereas Twitch thoughts don't really show anything and don't really do anything yet they make about 10 times as much. Don't work harder, work smarter. 2. Sending out nudes to everyone. A very common behaviour among thoughts. Thoughts thrive on compliments and require them regularly because a thought's attractiveness is usually their only achievement, so they require this to be complimented regularly so that they can validate their existence. Thoughts work in the same way as female ferrets. If female ferrets don't get laid, they go into extended heat and they die. Thoughts work in this exact same way, except with compliments. So whenever you see men complimenting the female streamers in the chat, they're not being creepy. They're saving lives. 1. The entitlement. The primary attribute to being a thought. Almost all thoughts are very attractive, and they think that this alone means that they should just get things. So despite the thought market being capitalist, thoughts are actually communists. And I'm being serious, try this out. Anytime that a thought asks you for something, tell them no, and just watch the absolute confusion come across their face as they try and wrangle with this concept of refusal that is absolutely foreign to them. These are some of the key behaviours that thoughts can display, however some of these behaviours on their own aren't confirmation that a girl is a thought, because sometimes it can just be standard female behaviour. There are other red flags too that can indicate whether or not a girl is a thought, but there needs to be some sort of graded classification system created in order to help us better understand it. Which is why I've created the special high intensity thought evaluation, also known as the shite. This is a scoring system that ranks women out of 100 so that you can not only establish whether or not they are a thought, but also what grade of thought they are. So we can go through the point scores that have been assigned to the four main behaviours. Four, a burning hatred for women. 5 points, 3 love for money, 5 points, 2 sending nudes to everyone, 15 points, and 1 the entitlement coming in at a strong 20 points. But there are other red flags that you should watch out for. Twitch streams or profile pictures showing an unnecessarily large amount of cleavage, 5 points. Having an Amazon wish list, 5 points. However this does go up to 10 points if there's sexy underwear on the list. Having a personal army of white knights. 10 points. Sleeping with other streamers or YouTubers in order to gain exposure. 20 points. And finally, a PayPal link in the Twitter bio. 10 points. And to classify the scores and their thresholds, I have created Dankula's hierarchy of thoughtness. 0 points. The god tier waifu. Not a single woman in earth falls into this category. I just put it in there to give them an unachievable goal to piss them off. 25 points. Not a thought, just has a few annoying traits which is pretty much standard for women. 50 points. Thought. Just your straightforward, everyday thought. We've also reached the non-relationship threshold. 
You do not date anyone at this threshold or above, unless you want to be penniless and miserable. Saying this script out loud is starting to sound very... MGTOW. 75 points. Mega thought. Do not approach. Avoid at all costs. Because you will die. 100 points. A legendary creature in a thought's final form. Luckily, it is very difficult for a thought to reach this level and none have been recorded in the present day. However, this creature has been referenced in the Bible and other ancient texts. They say that the appearance of this creature marks the beginning of the end times. A creature so powerful that it can drain PayPal accounts at will. A creature so powerful that it can turn you back into a virgin. If Elliot Rogers is the incel's god, then she would be their devil. The Thought Leviathan. Hopefully this video educated you enough to be able to identify thoughts, but that isn't where this quest for knowledge ends. There is another race of people that thoughts have actually been battling with since time immemorial, who we're going to discuss in the next video. Incels. But until then, stay safe, and remember, don't feed the thoughts. It's Count Dankula on YouTube. Everybody should subscribe.